Hey, this is Brett, and today I am excited to go over this brand new 2024 Jeep Wrangler two-door Sport S package in the all-new Anvil clear coat for 2024. This Jeep has the two-liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine, which puts out 270 horsepower, 295 foot-pounds of torque. It's paired up with the eight-speed automatic transmission. It's going to Gets you 21 miles per gallon highway 20 city for an average of 21 miles per gallon i'm going to go all the way around in this video i'm going to show you all the options on this particular jeep we're going to take a look at the original window sticker which is also going to be linked in the description below as well as a full description of this vehicle just show you all the options and give you a good walk around on this particular jeep i think it looks really good so the first thing you'll notice that is this is a Sport S package and it has the new grill. That is because it be, we optioned it out with the satin finish grill. Uh, the satin black finish grill gives you the updated grill on the Sport S package. This one also has the LED lighting and fog light group. So you get the LED headlamps, running lights, and fog lights there. One thing to note with that group, you still get the halogen lights in the fenders. You get the seven slotted grill on there, the tow hooks in the front. You also get these kind of uh, guards right there from things flying into the tires, which is kind of neat. And I think that's specific to the Sport and Sport S package. Anvil clear coat, really a good looking color. It's a kind of a gray, blue, almost green, kind of like a not really a seafoam green, that's more Earl. Anyways, let me know what you think of the color in the comments below. It does have the painted and polished aluminum 17 inch wheels, the updated center caps for 2024. Really like these wheels on this Jeep. It has Nexen Rody and ATX tires. These tires are really cool too. They have like rock design on the uh, lettering there. 245-75 R17 tires. And uh, these are kind of an all-terrain tire on there. Looks like they got a good amount of tread to them. A couple little Easter eggs, you get these sandals in the shroud. Now this one, they're very visible. The last two Jeeps I did, they could barely see them. Stamp must be wearing out. You get the Jeep climbing up the side of the windshield. You'll notice there's no more antenna on the 2024s because they put the antenna in the windshield with the Corning Gorilla Glass for the Sport S package. Uh, but you do get a new trail rated badge for the passenger side. Jeep and Wrangler lettering there. You get the T50 on there to let you know that you need the Torx 50 bit to get those doors off. We did a demo on how to take your doors off of your Jeep Wrangler JL. That video is in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. You do get four wheel disc brakes on the Wrangler. Full size spare tire. Get a better look at that tread pattern. LED license plate lights, get the normal halogen tail lamps. This one does have the case for the front hard top pieces back here. You got four bolts on each side to take this hard top off. We did a demo on how to take your hard top off your two door Wrangler. That's in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below if you want to check out that demo. These seats fold up like so, you can also remove them and I did a video on how to remove those as well. So that's a good video that's linked in the description below. These seats fold up like so. And then there is a little storage area underneath here, which is really nice uh, just to get that extra storage door hinge, roof and windshield bolt holders there as well. Another little Easter egg is you get seven slots on this back gate and you get a JL badge back here for two door, four door, wheelbase and overall length, as well as water fording where it was developed and built in. These doors swing nice and smoothly. Going down the driver's side here. One thing I wanted to note, this does have the enter and go system. So you just have to put your hand in there. It'll automatically unlock. If you have the key in your pocket, heated power mirrors inside the Sport S package gives you what they call black cloth interior i think it is dark charcoal let me know what you think in the comments below but you get the kind of gold stitching on there or bronze stitching factory floor mats you get this new badge for 2024 with the wrangler and the gladiator backed up to each other auto headlamps this one has the cloth dash 
with the gold trim on there or bronze trim. Power locks, power mirrors. And I keep saying that because I got yelled at in my 392 video I did. Apparently it says bronze right on the window sticker and I was calling it gold. Look at those second row seats. It does have latch child safety system if you want to try and get the car seat back there. So these seats roll like that and then back like so. The other new thing for 2024, as you can see it right here, side curtain airbags now standard on the Wranglers. So that's a really nice thing. This is my favorite steering wheel. I like the gold stitching on there. And they got this new leather for 2024. It's really a soft touch leather, but it's, it's firm at the same time. Adaptive cruise control, regular cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and audio controls in the back of the steering wheel. This one, of course, does have the 7-inch LCD display, and it's going to give you a digital speedometer. You get the Wrangler animation at the beginning there, and uh, we've gone over this a ton of times, so I'm not going to go over it too much. Uh, and what's also interesting is when the back hatch is open, now there is a little light that tells you about that. So this is the... Uconnect 5 12.3 inch touchscreen radio. This is the standard radio across all the trim levels. Um, however, you can get this with nav, and that's the only difference in the radio. Otherwise, the size and pretty much all the stuff you can do is going to be exactly the same. Uh, but you do get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on here, as well as USB and AUX jacks. Uh, you get your different vehicle apps on here, and you can check out the backup cam, which they've made those crystal clear nice and HD, which I like. And you get all your different apps on here. I'm not gonna go through everything just because it gets redundant, but basically all these apps or all these buttons are just links to different parts of the radio. You get Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, um, the backup camera off-road pages, which we'll check out briefly. And uh, so you get your steering angle, transfer case if it's locked or unlocked, and as you can see, as I turn that steering wheel, the angle changes and the tires up top change, which is pretty cool. You also get latitude, longitude, and altitude on their accessory gauges and pitch and roll. So the other thing that's new is these vents are now below the radio instead of on the side as uh, the round vents, and this top storage area for coins or whatever is a little different to it. It used to be just one big area, now it's two split down the middle there everything down here is your standard equipment this one does have heated seats heated steering wheel remote start it does have start stop capabilities stability control speed select crawl control and you get a usb usb c and an aux jack power windows four by four shifter you get the jeep logo on the top of the shifter there eight speed automatic keyless entry with remote start and you get your flipper key on there always like that with the jls with the flipper key Nice chunky key fob, and there's a spot to put that right there. Get your um, mechanical parking brake there. There's the original window sticker. Like I said, we're going to check that out in just a second. These front hard top pieces, pretty easy to get those off. Assist and SOS buttons, and uh, you also get your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems, and you can tell if you got the Gorilla Glass if it's got the Gorilla right there. Uh, so I'm going to do a final walk around here. And we're going to check out these lights. I'm going to turn off the lights in the picture studio so you can see just how bright they are and what this LED light group entails. I believe it's $14.95. We'll get to the window sticker here in just a second. Let me pause this. All right, you can see just how bright those lights are and that you do get the amber halogen lights in the fenders there. But the headlights and fog lights and running lights are all LEDs. They're all super bright and... Uh, really like that you can get those on the sport s package and look how bright they are they're nice and wide it's got a wide range there from side to side let me know what you think in the comments below and you get those led license plate lights normal halogen tail lamps as well so i'll turn the lights back on and we'll check out that original window sticker right now here is that original window sticker. And like I said, I'm, I'm gonna go through this briefly. It's linked in the description below if you really wanna like dig into it. But you get the two-door Sport S package. 
2 liter turbo, 8 speed automatic transmission, remember 270 horsepower, 295 foot pounds of torque. Everything on your left here is your standard equipment including those off-road info pages, command track, part-time four-wheel drive system, and the Uconnect with the 12.3 inch touchscreen display. Optional equipment starts with the Anvil Clear Coat, which is a $595 option. The 22S package or Sport S, which is 22S, that's the code, is a $3,500 value. Gives you the power heated mirrors, the premium wrapped steering wheel, windshield with Corning Gorilla Glass, anti lock four wheel disc brakes, deep tint sunscreen windows, remote keyless entry, full speed forward collision warning, plus adaptive cruise control advanced brake assist and sun visors with illuminated, illuminated vanity mirrors. The LED headlamp and fog light group is $14.95. Yes, just like I thought. Uh, convenience group is $19.95. You get the seven inch driver information, digital cluster display, heated front seats, heated steering wheel, front door passive entry and lock or the enter and go system, remote start system, air conditioning with automatic temperature control, which also gives you the dual climate controls and emergency assistance call. So a lot that you get with that 1995. Eight speed automatic transmission is 2,500 bucks and the three piece hard top is 1695. The satin black grill to give you the updated grill is only 325 bucks. So if you order one of these Sport S's, get the satin black grill and you'll get the upgraded grill. 495 for the tires and then the 17 by seven and a half inch aluminum wheels are 1,095 bucks. Total MSRP on this one is 47,585. If you want to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives on this particular Jeep in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to this vehicle on our website with all the pricing and incentives and discounts. And it's also linked in the description below. Three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain and 21 miles per gallon highway 20 city and an average of 21 miles per gallon four and seven on the economy and small gradings and it's not really rated for uh, safety ratings yet and it's three stars for rollover for the only one there anyway so that's the original window sticker like i said it's linked in the description below if you really want to check out that more but thank you so much for checking out the video if you like the video remember to like subscribe and share on the youtube channel and to see more pictures of this jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars trucks suvs minivans and especially wranglers go to summitauto.com right there full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle all at summitauto.com if you want to check out more hd videos you can go to youtube.com summitauto click the bell notifications get updates on the videos i do each and every day stay current on our vast and ever-changing inventory here at summit auto in fact any second you will see a link to subscribe to my youtube channel in the upper left a link to all the jeep wrangler videos i've ever done over 500 videos in the upper right link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left and a link to one of our latest youtube videos in the lower right click those check us out check out the links below um, in the description and thank you so much for checking out the video we're super excited to help you with this ultra good looking 2024 jeep wrangler two-door sport s in anvil clear coat thank you so much for checking out the video remember to like subscribe and share on the youtube channel i really really appreciate it thank you so much